Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Avis. Welcome back to another episode. Today we're going to talk about the very cool, awesome brand new back accessories series. This one is made by I don't have a use, and in my opinion, for the price, these are probably some of the best looking back accessories on the Roblox UGC catalog. So I would say without further ado, let's start today's episode and let's take a look at all of these amazing back accessories. Alright boys and girls, there we go, so background music is running, let's head over to the avatar shop and let's take a look at all of these brand new amazing scythes by I don't have a use, these are mainly scythes but very very awesome in my opinion, they cost 150 robux and yeah I would just say let's take a look at all of these. So first of all we have right here the royal sapphire scythe, this one costs 150 robux, looks, looks absolutely amazing, very very nice one. Next up we have of course the obsidian scythe, also 150 robux, the molten scythe the pink princess scythe and the acid scythe and to be quite fair these kind of remind me of the old scythes by Urius so as an example right here we have some other scythes by Urius um, there we go as an example we have the golden one the fuelman the red scythe of the seeker we have the green one we have the royal scythe the void one we have the arcanist and the invictus one so these are pretty awesome these were very very detailed by Urius but now we have some even more detailed scythes these are made but I don't have a use and I would just say let's start with the first one, the Royal Sapphire Scythe. 150 Robux, looks pretty amazing, it's one of my favorite back accessories, very nice color combination of blue, golden and then this, well, kind of gray. Pretty amazing, 1108 favorites and was lastly updated on August 13th, pretty awesome. Next up we have the Obsidian Scythe which is also 150 Robux and was also lastly updated on August 13th, so quite interesting. It's only a few days ago and 458 favorites, so pretty awesome. By the way, this is how both of these look on my avatar, just kind of an idea, I guess. Next up, we have right here the Molten Scythe. This one is very, very, very detailed, not gonna lie, it really looks amazing, the lava. And this one was also lastly updated on August 13th, pretty cool, 541 favorites, very awesome item. And next up, we have right here the Pink Princess Scythe for 150 Robux, this one looks pretty cool, was also lastly updated on August 13th, and 397 favorites. And last but not least, we have the Acid Scythe for 150 Robux, also lastly updated on August 13th, and 384 favorites. And now the comparison, I guess, um, to the old Scythes by Urius. So these ones all are 150 Robux that are very, very detailed, and they're pretty big as well. So you can see right there on my avatar, it's just pretty gigantic for a back accessory. And we also had, of course, the ones by Urius. And now the good thing about the ones by I don't have use is these are pretty inexpensive. They're super detailed for 150 Robux. And the ones by Urius were, as an, well, as an example of 500 Robux, or one of them, the Golden Scythe, was originally 150, but now it's 10,000 Robux. And then most of them are around like 500. And during sales, you get those for 250 Robux on a discount, but mainly they're 500 Robux. So you save actually 350 Robux. If you buy the ones by I don't have a use, links will be in the description down below. I think these are super detailed, um, probably as good as the ones by Urius, but they're a little bit more, well, affordable, I guess. We can call it like that, hopefully. And then we also have some other very, very awesome scythes by I don't have a use, the Toxic Lord scythe, the Corrupt one, and the Void one. Right here, the Corrupt one costs 150 Robux, 435 favorites. The Void one costs 150 Robux as well, with 1,798 favorites. And lastly updated on July 30th, by the way. And then the other one, the Toxic one, costs 150 Robux and 322 favorites, and also was lastly updated during July 23rd. So these are pretty cool in my opinion. I think there's quite a few very awesome scythes, but these are definitely my favorite ones. If you're a big fan of the Katuni series, we can also take a look at two Katuni outline scythes. We have the Dark Matter scythe for 100 Robux by Cody Def, 7,100 favorites. And then of course the Rainbow Gut Scythe for 150 Robux and 31,000 favorites. So yeah, I think those were the main important scythes in my opinion. And I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I hope you had a little bit of fun. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.